Today we are talking about bass. Bass? And recording bass from the Supertone Records studio. I'm drinking some lemon tea here in my Didario mug. Nearly finished, all fantastic. So, how do we mic a bass guitar amp? Well, very simple. This is the sort of set we use on Blueberry Pie, our latest. No, 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 just come on, let's go to the, let's go to the DI first. <laughs> my God, the, the signal goes in here. It's what water. Is oh, I know, okay. okay. So the water, i.e. signal, goes into the Avalon U5 DI first. That's what we do. Yeah. No EQ or anything. And then straight out in this bit of George L's cable, and straight into the mighty high watt 201 uh, valve head from about 1972-73. Serviced, incidentally, by Roland Lummy, <laughs> who is actually a great guy who services all our stuff in England. Him and Dan Whitlock Jones, fantastic service people. And it sounds amazing. KTH8 is fantastic. Anyway, yes. let's get back on. So this actually goes through this Bergantino 6x10 cab. We're not using a vintage cab because they're a bit flappy and flobby and, and not tight enough, really, I don't think. Anyway, mm. so what do we use? We use a Neumann U47 FET circa 1978 and a, a Sennheiser MD421 Mark II. If we notice, the MD421 Mark II... It's not pointing straight at the speaker, no. It's pointing at 90 degrees to the cone, as it should be. Because otherwise, it will sound properly shit. Well, probably. Of course, you've got to listen to these things. The, the, four, the, uh, the, the U47 FET is facing not too close, but again, not right in the middle of the cone. That's all good. Why so is that? Why is that? Why not in the middle? Well, the thing is, in the middle of the cone, all the top end comes right in the middle, and you tend to get a lot of ee. <laughs> we don't want a lot of ee coming out of it. We want more woo. Which is sort of, you know, because you put it in the middle, it'll, it'll, it'll sound like eep. Anyway, yeah. okay, thank you for that, that okay. coming. So that's it. So that's how we record bass at the Superton Record Studio, specifically for the album Blueberry Pie, and for virtually, well, most people that come in recording Americana blues and rock and roll music. See you later. Hi, what? <laughs>